Our heroes are on their way to Cinnabar Island and Ash battles against the trainer. Ash uses Bulbasaur against his Rhyhorn. After a fierce battle, Bulbasaur wins. It is hurt, and weak after the battle. Its bulb glows. Ash takes it to Pokemon Center. Nurse Joy says Bulbasaur is getting ready to evolve after her examination. The flowers bloom. Nurse Joy says Bulbasaur from all over the gather at a mysterious garden every year, where they evolve. Pikachu sees Bulbasaur going out of Pokemon Center and follows it. A group of Bulbasaur capture Ash's Bulbasaur and runs away. Pikachu wakes up everyone, and they find Bulbasaur missing. Team Rocket tries to capture them, and gets blasted off. Pikachu leads them. They follow the stream of pollen. The forest tries to stop them, but they move in. They enter the mysterious garden Nurse Joy said. They find a huge group of Bulbasaur. The pollens converge into a tree, making it to grow and bloom. A Venusaur comes out from the tree. After some chanting, the Bulbasaur all start to evolve into Ivasaur. Ash's Bulbasaur refuses to evolve. The Venusaur commands it to evolve but Bulbasaur refuses. Venusaur uses Vine Whip, but Ash interferes and takes the hit. You probably feel like it ruined your festival, and I'm very sorry about that. But if Bulbasaur doesn't want to evolve yet, I don't think you should have the right to force it to. Venusaur shows its power of manipulating nature, but Bulbasaur is not interested. Team Rocket enters the mysterious garden and uses a giant vacuum to capture all the Ivasaur. Venusaur uses its vines to save them. Ash's Bulbasaur uses Razor Leaf, but it's not powerful enough against their machine. Team Rocket makes fun of it and decides not to capture it, making Bulbasaur angry and learned a new move. It uses a powerful solar beam to blast Team Rocket away and Razor Leaf to free all the captured Ivasaur. Venusaur understood Bulbasaur's decision and thanks it for its help. Our heroes say goodbye and continue their journey.